It's happening. Olushegun Obasanjo replies Tinubu, religious influence on Nigerian politics, we must stop it. This is coming on the heels of um, the information we are receiving that uh, Obas uh, Tinubu has assured Northern Cabal that he will take a Northern uh, Muslim to be his running mate. This is after he's gone to make consultation and they told him that they are okay with him being a presidential candidate, but who will be his vice president as they don't want a Christian um, Northerner to be his running mate. They want a Northerner, a Muslim Northerner to be his running mate. And, um, you know, Tinubu told them that they should not be afraid, that that is not a problem. That, in fact, the South-South, the Southeast is inconsequential in the whole matter. And they don't have a say. That the only people who will kick against it and will say no, it has to be if he's a Muslim and is from the south, it should be a Christian Muslim, a Christian uh, 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 northerner, it should be a Christian northerner that should be his running mate. Tinubu said he would take care of that and assure them that he would pick, he will pick a a northern Muslim, which will not make it a north a, a not a Muslim Muslim ticket. Uh, and just said, you don't do things like that. You don't. Those things you are thinking about is part of what we don't want in the country. So this is where this is coming from. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Religious influence on Nigerian politics. Obasanjo talks to Tinubu. Chief Olusha Obasanjo was a Muslim, adding until the 19th 98 when he converted to christianity while in prison the reason to simply for reasons for him to simply become nigerian's president it's con it's convenient for uh, it's inconvenient it's not convenient for the muslim north to miss out of one or two position in the country in Nigerian setting. And when Olusegun set settling for presidency, the stumbling block then was his religion because he's from the south, but his religion will go against it. Who was desperate for limelight grabbed the suggestion with his both hands. That was when it was sealed and delivered. The same obstacle is facing now Tinubu who is working on to become Nigerian's president. The Muslim North cannot play second folly to a Christian counterpart, and Tinubu knows this. So APC knows that Tinubu's candidates will see him choose a Christian running mate from the North. This has been kicked against by APC Cabal, who told Tinubu categorically that they will not appreciate him choosing a northern Christian to be his running mate, but instead they want a northern Muslim to be his running mate. Tinubu now went ahead and assured them that he would pick a northern Muslim, particularly from the north south, not west, to be his running mate. Now, if Tinubu chooses a northern Muslim, the majority of Christians in the south and north will vote PDP. Why the PDP Muslim running mates will divide the Muslims because he has chosen a Christian running mate. So the position of religion is affecting Tinubu's position and this is coming on on the heels of him yielding to the advice of Olusegwa Basanjo to do right by the people. So, Ulushegwa Basanjo, in, in, in his own opinion, is you do right by the people. But what does doing right by the people mean? Doing right by the people could mean many things. Do right by the people could mean a lot of things. What is doing right by the, What does it really mean? What does doing right by the people, what does it mean after all? So, they said Ulushegwa Basanjo, you know, converted to become a Christian, you know, in 1998, you know, when 1989, when he was in prison, you know, and uh, 1998, I beg your pardon, you know, and, um, you know, he had to convert because uh, there were issues there. And for him to 
take on that position. He has to do, he has to follow, you know, uh, the orders and powers that be. Okay, so for things to be done decently and in order so that everybody to a large extent is happy, he had to just, you know, follow, you know, follow the suits. And now he's asking Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinobu to do right by the people. So what is Ashiwaju Bola Tinobu's right by the people? What does it mean? Because if you listen, listen very well, that's just not like an ambiguous statement saying, do right by the people. So with Tinobu follow the yid, okay, will he follow the yid and you know, pick on a, 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 a Christian northerner. And then if he does that, the northerners, the cabal who are saying to him, will not support you, will not support him. Yes, they won't support him. And, and so he'll be left in that state of what we call dilemma. So he will be there. So what exactly is he going to do? What is the, what, what's, what's, what's going to happen to Tinubu presidential uh, election? Uh, we also know that the People Democratic Party, although nobody has formally, you know, been chosen as the the party representative, they've not even conducted their primaries. But we know that we know significantly that there are people who are intending for such a position, who are working on to see to it that they get to such a position, are doing all they can to get to that position. Yes. Now these people who are working in every way, some of them, you know, uh, we know that most of them okay the muslim ones will pick a christian uh, candidate yes they will pick a christian candidate to be their running mate a christian candidate from the south to be their running mate so what will happen what will happen if that is done so if you look at it there is a lot involved in all of this there's a lot involved so my wonderful people this is what is going on and uh, we'll keep you informed uh, Lucia Gobasan just called to him is just do right by the people. Okay. Do right by the people. We will, we will keep you informed as the matter unfolds. Okay. Uh, remember that every one of us have got a duty to speak out the truth because these people, they don't care what happens to anybody All they care about to a large extent, you know, um, is their political influence. So whatever happens to anybody, they can't be bothered. It will shock you to know that that's how they think and they feel. That's what they do. Leave us a comment. We'd we'll love to hear from you. God bless you. Have a lovely day. Don't forget to like us, share, and subscribe. From us is bye for now. Bye.